here in Linwood and we're gonna check out today the Citadel Miami. And there's a special spot in there that we've been dying to check out for a long time now. Yes, the USBS burger. Mm -hmm. Plus some other things too. Yes. We're gonna check out the rooftop and get a drink. We're here at the rooftop bar. I got the Mrs. Negroni. And, and I got a Cesarac. Cesarac, cheers. <laughs> So we can tr finally try the USBS burger, which we've heard so many things about because of Burger Beast. Yes. He was the one that said that it was the best burger in Miami. Last year. Last year. Right. So, you know, we gotta, we gotta find out because last time we checked, Babe's was the best burger in Miami. In so, our opinion. In yes. our opinion. I think our burger's ready. Oh, okay. Hey, thank you. <laughs> All right, we got our our double patty USBS burger. It looks extremely juicy. I'm excited. Best burger in Miami, let's find out. That's ridiculous. <laughs> Same as Babes or up there, pair hand in hand with Babes? <laughs> I'll say hand in hand. Wow. You guys, right here, one of the best burgers in Miami. <laughs> oh, wow. It's one of the best, if not the best. But Babes is also up there, so much love to Babes Burgers. But this burger is like ridiculous. So good. And it seems pretty simple. I think it's just meat and cheese. I think if you have the best, if you have a really good burger, like if the meat is good, then you don't need much more. Like meat and cheese. Meat and cheese is all you need. Not even bacon. Mm -mm. And we usually like bacon in our burgers. Today is also $10 pasta Sunday, so we might have to get one of these. <laughs> we ended up getting the spaghetti puttanesca, which we've never tried before. And I was a little weird about it because of the anchovies. He did give us some Parmesan. There's anchovies, black olives, capers. Capers, garlic. It's definitely a flavorful white spaghetti. Wine sauce. Yeah, he explained it to San us. Mozano, and it's... tomatoes. <laughs> he explained it to us, and it definitely sounded like a lot of fun. The the chef said it was his personal well, favorite. Everyone there said it was their favorite. Yeah. Good. Can I put some parmesan? Yeah. I feel like Parmesan makes everything even better. For someone like me who doesn't like olives, capers, and anchovies, <laughs> it's, it's good. good. It's good, yeah. <laughs> Must be the good chef. Honestly, I don't think we liked it. <laughs> I don't think we liked it. I mean, we couldn't even finish it. <laughs> it was really good. Really good pasta for $10 at Porti Pasta Bar, right over there. Now we need some dessert and maybe some coffee. We're already getting full, so. Yeah. I wanted to eat more, but. We 
you decided to get one more cocktail. This one has coffee. Yeah. yeah. A little coffee that, beans. Have vodka, Frangelico, Baileys. Vodka, Frangelico, Baileys. Cold brew. Cold brew. It and, looks beautiful. Yeah. And we got some coquito flavored ice cream. To say like coquito? It's like vanilla ice cream. But... Vanilla ice cream? <laughs> it's supposed to be coquito. I taste a hint of rum. Really? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's good. got some coffees to go and everything we tried was delicious we could not eat as much food as we wanted to because we got really full <laughs> the USBS burger was amazing and the pasta $10 pasta on Sundays is definitely worth it and uh, the drinks the coffee the dessert the coquito ice cream everything was good so we'll have to come back and check out more Toodaloo.